Hello, gamers. Oh, sheesh. Welcome back to another amazing live stream by yours truly. How are we all doing today? You you really truly do get some duality with the Persona 4 soundtrack. Uh, that was a song from the Persona 4 soundtrack. I have never heard that before, but, you know, I, I was bopping. I was like, well, hopefully they don't copyright claim me for this, but it's, it's already too late. It's already playing, you know? I just let it happen. <laughs> But yes, yes, we're playing some more L.A. Noir. We're due for that, too. So that's what we decided to play because, you know, I want to be a little vice vice boy. We got our first vice case. I can't remember if we completed it or not. I guess we'll find out. Oh, wait, I actually remember when that's that song played in P4. I honestly don't. <laughs> So, so I I believe you. Whenever whenever you say it, play it, I'll be like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Memory of a goldfish. Anyways, let me switch you guys over to the gamer screen. Pause the beats. Oh my gosh. I don't know what's going on with Moon's stream. His 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 stream has pinged the streams channel like four times. But anyways. <laughs> Let me. Oh, wait, this is not even showing me my stream. Can you refresh the page? Thank you. Thank you. Okay, there we go. Okay. Resume. We're on Vice Narcotics, baby. Oh, you're right. <laughs> when they all sued. I don't even think it was a month, bro. It was like three days. And they were like, all right, you guys, <laughs> let's perform. <laughs> Listen, but like, Yosuke was coming in clutch. He 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 already knew how to play guitar. I mean, listen, he's always listening to music, got his headphones on. What are we doing and why are we standing out here? Where am I? Where's my car? Hey, okay, hold on. I gotta stir my drink. Okay. Um, did we already do what we needed to do here? Or I, like, don't actually remember. Do we? Do I need to go in here for some reason? How do I run? Oh, it's this. Oh. You know what would help if I gave... Shift tab. Sorry, I forgot to give you guys desktop audio. There you go. My fault, my fault. You're good now, though. Okay. Um. What are we doing, bro? Can I talk to you? I'm at a loss. I'd say it's time to have that talk with Lenny the Fink. Let's pay him a visit. Who's Lenny the Fink, bro? <laughs> yeah, I, I, I realize I forgot to put the, the desktop audio on. <laughs> Oopsies. Let's go to this place. I don't- Is Audi serious? Is the LAPD turning a blind eye to narcotics? Keep your shirt on, Phelps. Wait, I'm Drugs driving? Drugs are prohibited. Doesn't mean people don't want to take them. Limiting supply doesn't mean that we have limited demand. I understand that. I, I know drive. that the average Joe needs to unwind a little, let his hair down at the end of the week, but morphine? Heroin? It's important to demonize hop, Phelps. Looks good in the papers. But when all is said and done, it's just another chemical like booze. A lot of people in high places think we're doing the city a favor by keeping the dope rolling into Central Avenue. Donnelly certainly believes we need to keep them anesthetized. Better jobs and opportunities would go a lot further. Will you listen to yourself? Damn, bro, this is the longest red light ever. Can we, like, why do I have to go through traffic in video games? Are they saying I haven't done it enough in real life? Oh, I need to take that turn. Oh, no, wait, actually, I lied. <laughs> All units, officers need help. Hollywood and Highland. Hollywood and Highland, officers need help. 211 in progress and shots fired. Unit to handle code 3, identify.
If I, if I take this, y'all not gonna run me over, right? Ah! Just a little nick. Don't worry about it. He's speaking, uh, he's speaking real for that. Making drugs illegal doesn't do much. Yeah, because then it's just gonna peddle more illegal substances. Dude, how how far am I? Yeah, it just makes people want it more. I mean, you know what they always say? Like, the grass is greener on the other side. Okay, so I literally just have to take a uh, left on Hollywood and just go down and I'm there. What is this, though? Junkie's apartment. Black, Black Caesar food hut. Okay. Okay, bro. Ah! Like, y'all see me with my lights on. Well, you don't see me. You hear me with my lights on. Why are you not moving? Like, this person could be dead already. <laughs> Literally. Ah! I'll merge a little faster, pal. Oh my god. How many times am I gonna have to do that? Like, all, all, all I need to do is sh drive down a straight road. Did someone just get hit? Like, why did you do that? Like, that just made it worse. If you had just stayed where you were, like, you trying to move over was worse. Okay. We made it. Jesus Christ. What have we got? Three guys tried to knock the place over and got jumped. Now they got a half dozen patrons and staff for insurance. Do we know the situation inside? Two inside covering the hostages. Plus this charmer at the front door. We need to do something about him now, sir. He won't negotiate. Don't kill this poor bastard if we don't put him down. Don't they know I have impeccable aim? You come any Move up! Ah! Hurry! There's still someone in there! Ah! He's lucky I can't find him. I got you now, Ow, dude! And that's why th that's why they call me Guns of Blazing Coal, for real. <laughs> Car 11K, code four at Hollywood First National Bank, corner of Hollywood and Highland. Suspects are down. I need an ambulance and notify the coroner. <laughs> tee -hee, tee -hee. Roger on the ambulance, 11 K. All units, be advised. Suspects are down at Hollywood First National at the corner of Hollywood and Highland. <laughs> Period. Um. Hello, Sierra. I'm eating a cupcake. What kind of cupcake? You're driving, Pookie. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. I need to go over these case notes. Trust. How do we all choose to eat our cupcakes? Um, if I'm feeling lazy, just like the way it comes, but like, you know, if I'm actually trying to enjoy it, I like take the bottom half off and put it on top like a little sandwich. <laughs> Oh, by the way, Luna, you know there's a setting in StreamCord bot Factors not to repost closed. a live message if one's already been posted. Years. Listen, I have no idea How anything about StreamCord. That's all Pidgey. <laughs> with all those newfangled refrigerators. Save it for someone who wants to hear it. How many janitors carry a GAT? That's one way of announcing we're here. I'm sorry, I missed Give whatever up, was being Steve. said. Your brother-in-law will get you a good lawyer. My brother-in-law hates my guts. Come and get me if you want some daylight through that suit of yours. Come on and get massacred, cocksuckers! Ow, dude. 
Oh my god, Phelps. This one's got your name on it. Hello? Eyes open. It's around here somewhere. Throw out the guns. You're loose, mister. Come get me. What the hell is the matter? I'm wide You're open so here. Kill these assholes already. <laughs> I got you. Damn, bro, I missed twice. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Depending on how much it, how much is on it, frosting first. This is the correct way. Oops. See, I don't want to. If there's no, if, if I eat all the frosting, then I'm not gonna want to eat the cake part. You know. Luna, your sandwich was also acceptable. Thank you. <laughs> factory. Damn, bro, I gotta do this part again. Oh. Okay, no. Call me a cocksucker. Weapons on the ground now. I see him there. Eyes open. He's around here somewhere. Clear me some space here. Can you? I want you to go. I want. To, I want you to go on. Oh god, it's fine. This one's got your name on it. You dead or alive? Be honest. I got you now, motherfucker. What the hell is the matter? Can someone please just kill me, asshole? Give me some goddamn cover. Find some cover. You're fucking. Home. Space here. Ow, dude. Stay in cover. Bro, please. Are you trying to get yourself killed? I ain't running out of friends or guns in here anytime soon. Understand? Get in cover. Oh, everybody's in cover. Relax. Push forward. Wait, can I pick this up? Ah! Come get me. Bro, you better not die. I'm wide open here. How long do you think you can hold out? Take cover, you lunatic! Hello? Oh, Pookie, what are you doing? Alright, well, he started running, so I guess I'm gonna run. Give me some goddamn- Get in cover, now! <laughs> I don't even know where they're shooting from! Oh, up there, it would seem. Clear me some space here! Hello? Ah! Stay down! Oh, dude, right there! I'm gonna put holes in you! I'm wide open here! See your hat got knocked off. You look so bald. Where? I don't know where he's shooting from. Oh, somewhere over here. Oh! Stay in cover! Give me some goddamn cover! Bro, I'm trying. You're just shooting ice, bro. Bro. Flip drive. Yeah, Ripley's believe it or not, oh if God, you shoot me, I'm gonna shoot you back. Cake part is great on its own, no slander on that. Listen, not for me, man. It's a, it's a little too... How do I get up? Oh, there's stairs over here. It's a little too, uh, I don't know. Just I need something else there. <laughs> I 
can't. Sorry, I can't talk because the cupcake is distracting me. That's They're actually valid. Finkelstein. Leave the weapon and put your hands up now. Shove them in the machine. Up. Sure. Then what? Cop the peddling the dope? Cut a deal? Ship me off to the queue? As soon as I get locked up, some old friend puts a, an ice pick above my ear? No thanks. Only one other way out, shit heel. Ah! Bro, my hands weren't on the controller. My hands were literally not on the controller. I was fully just, I was like, la la la, taking a sip of my drink. They're all dead. So it's coming. <laughs> Let's have a look around. Now that we finally got some peace and quiet. Are you sure we shouldn't double tap just in case? I think I've had enough ice for one day. Until the scotch I pour myself as soon as we get out of here. What? Three guesses what's in the box. Open her up, Cole. It's morphine. Yippee. This stuff has got to be worth at least a hundred grand. So Finkelstein robbed the ship? <laughs> My guess is Lenny took it off their hands. This is big. This is gonna make the papers, Phelps. As senior investigator, I'll do the talking. Yeah, please. You know some of these people are taking some of this home. Well, well. Who would have thought that Roy Earl's hand-picked new partner would have turned out to be such a great case man? This is a good result, Phelps. As far as we can tell, Lenny the Fink was moving the morphine across the city and as far north as Frisco. This makes the feds very happy, and it makes Mickey Cohen look bad. I won't lie to you, kid. I like the headlines. I like them a lot. You keep this squad in the papers, and we'll get along just fine. Period. You ain't even got a cupcake. Listen, I was, I was drinking. I was hydrated. <laughs> but I like how your partner emptied an entire clip in him and he still didn't die. I know, right? But I died from like three bullets. Oh, I missed a clue and a question, bro. The death of Lenny Finkelstein should keep administrative vice in the headlines for now. <gasps> for now. Period. Perks of the job. A little morphine as a treat. <gasps> Reefer Madness! Reefer for Madness, Reefer for Madness. There's you a there's a movie Calhoun. called Reefer for Madness that they made sure, into a musical Freddy movie. Needs money to get out of town. A long time ago. And I Says watched that he's musical prepared movie. to blow the whistle on a primo reefer distribution ring. Says he Has can. Has he said how much it's going to cost? Fifty bucks. And the department will front me the fifty. You can put in an expense claim. He's over at Mike Lyman's on Hollywood Boulevard. See what you can find out. Dude, we're gonna. I hope. I hope. Uh, I hope Cole gets a uh, gets to smoke weed this episode. I, I hope like we burn down the building and he gets like high from it. <laughs> Wait, this isn't the right door. The exit's the other way. But hey, let's let's have a seat out on the on the patio out here. Don't walk away. <laughs> Like you haven't said gay or shit to me. Get, get, get the fuck out of my foot, bitch! <laughs> Listen, I hate the fact that, like he, like I know this is the 1940s, and you know people are gonna be racist because it's the 1940s. But like, I feel like every other character is less racist than than this guy is. I'd say on a scale of dull to scintillating, you're a solid tedious today, which you can be pleased with. Oh my god. Do you ever listen to yourself? I don't have the same voices in my head as you do, Cole. I would say, like, even Galloway was... With everything that Galloway said, he's less worse than, than you are. I already forgot what your name is. <laughs> Wait, I'm sorry. This I we we went the wrong way again. Uh, I don't know. I think I'm on crack. I think I'm already smoking that reefer madness. Okay, let me just follow the convenient exit signs, and we can go home. <laughs> Guys, the signs are there for a reason. Follow them. You're driving. You can drive. <laughs> the voices. I love reefer madness. <laughs> 
<laughs> no, you're right. This guy's a tool. Yeah, but like he's like the gayest out of all of our partners. Like he literally is constantly trying to like you know do some like rivals to lovers shit. And I'm like, oh. like I'd be on this. Like it's okay that you're an asshole, but like if you weren't like hella racist even for the times, you know we we could have had something. When the hell is the food gonna arrive? Because they had a they had a scene in the last one, um, at the start of the last case that we did, where they were like face to face, bro. They they There's were about to touch snake. lips, That's and there was also the, the back, fact Cole. that like he joked, uh, our partner joked about like uh the place that we met not food being a good great. first date spot. And I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm like what? <laughs> hey, oh sorry, this is not the X button. Freddy, that is the you're looking X good. Way. You're gonna help me, right? That's what I'm here for. You got the money? The 20? Sure, yeah. right here. 20? I said... You want the money or the alternative? Tell us about the reefer, Freddy. Who's he? Another good Samaritan. Answer the question. Grass comes from Tijuana. They bring in 50 pounds a week. 50 pounds? Are you hallucinating, Freddy? Get stashed at a house at... Bro, mind you, we're talking hella loud in this diner where there's people right behind us. We're like, where the, where's the marijuana? Like, girl, be a little bit, like, inconspicuous. 1452 North Las Palmas. Names, Freddy. The guy at the house is a spick that goes by the name Juan Garcia Cruz. But be careful. He likes guns. Now, do I get my money? Do me a favor, Freddy. Spend the money on a bus ticket. You can't last forever on a snitch jacket. <laughs> Let's go visit this cruise character. 50 pounds of dope. Crazy. Did they have weed back then? Yes. <laughs> Listen, I don't know, like, how do you look up a question like that? It's not like, when was weed invented? I get, like, <laughs> when. Discovered, I guess. It says cannabis has been used by humans for thousands of years. So, forever, basically. <laughs> when Wake there up, were humans, Cole. there were weeds. <laughs> there was one whole weed. Okay, we're going somewhere. Now showing Crossfire. Oh my god, do you want to go? I have no idea what that movie is. Or if it's a real you movie. You know the way. Not. You can drive. All right, Juan where Garcia to? Garcia Cruz's residence. <laughs> all drugs are forever. Literally. Yeah, how come all the games you play have two main characters that are obviously dating? I don't know, man. I guess I have sure. a type of game. A hophead like Freddy would raffle his sister for his next score. Or all games are gay. Whichever, whichever one you like better. <laughs> Every game is gay. <laughs> Especially when I'm playing it. Oh, hell no! Oh, we're close. Call for help. Find the way in. Every game is gay if you try hard enough, and trust me, I try hard enough. Okay, oh, dude, he shot my hand off! I got hit one time, bro, and I died? Huh? Nani? Like, how do I not get shot, bro? Stop, stop, stop. Oh, sorry, we don't need any help. We don't need any help. I, I dealt with it. You didn't have your hat to protect you, you're right. That's where I get my powers from. I wonder if there's a way that I couldn't. To move on. Next time I won't be so nice. 
I wonder if we could make them not die. Like, if we just waited, would they have come in and been arrested? Or, like, did I have to kill them? I don't know. You guys don't have to leave a mess. What happened? Dope peddler, Juan Cruz. You open fire and, well, the rest of the story tells itself. Can you click it, please? Thank you. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Is this a drug or a village in Borneo? Doesn't appear to be in Spanish. All right, let me see this body, baby. Wow, I killed this guy, and now I'm examining his body. I don't think there's anything on this one. There's probably something inside his suit jacket, because there, like, always is. I stepped away for a minute to fuck happen to him. Listen, they opened fire on us, and so... I thought they took these things out of circulation. And so I shot and killed them both. You know, typical cop stuff. Oh, no! I didn't want that. Put that down. Yeah, I lit him up. Listen, I mean, like, we didn't even come in violent. They... They are the ones who, uh, shot first. Oh, this is he. Juan Garcia Cruz. This is his address, but this place looks like a front. And no money in his wallet, because boy broke as hell. Is that it? I think so. Wow, a beer bottle that doesn't mean anything. Doesn't give me anything to go on. <clears throat> Damn, bro. Oh. Wow, he really saw me out here and said, never mind. Like, my fault. Oh my god! Gotta be something big, right? Cole, I did not ask you to jump the- Where are you going? Are you following me? Oh, there's a shack back here. Oh, sorry. I don't know what I thought he was gonna do for a second. Ooh, what's this? Sugar? Doesn't appear to be connected. <laughs> wow, bolts. <laughs> I like when uh, I choose to pick th sure things up and the texture loads in more. <clears throat> what is this? Like feed? Like chicken feed? I think that's it. Wow, I'm gonna pick all of these up again. <laughs> oh! <gasps> now we're getting somewhere. Well, girl, I didn't even look in the house. Hold on, stay there. Look at him thinking he's mad cool. <sighs> Damn it! Uh, I hate when people are bad people. Like, why are you? Why did you? Why did you have to go and do that? <laughs> let me check. The, let me finish checking the house first. I don't think so. Espanol, English, English, Espanol. What's this? 
<clears throat> Ooh, he was an artist. <gasps> it's weed, dude. That's weed. That's weed right there. Right there. Morphine in the front, canned food in the back. Wild. Wait, did did was there anything in there? Is there something I actually have to point to? Or is the tap mechanic just still- wait. Is it just still in here? Right? Right there! Sorry, I just had to do it. I, I don't think there's anything with this. <laughs> it's just cool- it's just cool art. It's the hookah. <laughs> Ammo? Probably nothing. Yeah, just uh, just some boxes of ammo, but it's fine. You catch all the good ones, Phelps. What did I just buzz over? Oh god! Oh my god! I don't think there's anything really crazy for me to look at. Because I was going to say, it doesn't tilt. It tilts like this way and then like this way. And that doesn't really do me anything. Oh. Tomato soup. Now if I open this, is doesn't it going to be drugs? Meals anymore. Junkies feeding on popcorn and grasshoppers living on soup. Okay, sorry. I didn't, I didn't know if they were going to say more. I was like, okay. <gasps> Another gun. Not everything here is going to be relevant. But what if I want to keep it? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Good morning to Luna and her lunatics. That's 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 us, that guys. Thing. That really is. I swear, Cole has to, has the greatest main character buff I've ever seen in a game. He figures shit out. That's that's uh, that's theirs on reason. He should figure it out just because you are playing him. Yeah. Sorry, I did not read that right, but <laughs> I I I my eyes read it to my brain right, but my mouth didn't. <laughs> what is this? Needles? Oh no, they're pencils. Is it actually pencils? Listen, you know, he, either way, he's just, you know, he's goaded with the sauce. He's built different. <laughs> Dude. With with my inability to read and your inability to to type, we make a very illiterate person. <laughs> Kick the shit back open. Ah! Oh yeah, I didn't look at the other cans. Wow. I don't think this is anything. Definitely some nails. Listen, I'm just waiting to see if there was drugs inside. <laughs> are all the detectives just happy that these are all are, are all soup boxes without looking at them? Literally, I'm assuming they're gonna have like a different team come in. Oh, this is a chicken coop. Um, I'm assuming they're gonna have a different team come in and like go through it more intensely, but they're just like getting enough. Is there something else I need to be hitting? More soup? Who in the hell keeps a secret stash of soup? Me. Me when I love soup. Dude, I get to use a can opener. Stop! Is there weed in the soup, bro? You hungry or something, Phelps? 
Yeah, hungry for weed. <gasps> this is really good. Those are huge nuggets, by the way. I'd say that's pretty good value for 12 cents. Factory sealed. Someone at the cannery has a lot of explaining to do. That's a huge chunk. Holy shit. Turns out two halves do make a whole period. <laughs> Herbal soup. Yeah, definitely. Holy shit. Like, that's huge. <laughs> Why is it kind of cute, though? Like, oh my god, here's my little vintage tomato soup. Just kidding. It is marijuana. <laughs> Crack them all open. Oh my god, it's more weed. Let's go. I like how I'm... Open both cans of soup. Soup in the pot is the achievement I just got. There's an achievement to open both of these cans. So I, I you know, I did not need to do that. <laughs> got that aesthetic packaging out exactly see this is what i mean there's no reason to check inside the can of soup for weed <laughs> i mean to be honest with you i would i mean because last time the the morphine was like on the bottom of the popcorn container loki like if it wasn't on the bottom i would have like taken the popcorn out and checked on the bottom of the inside <clears throat> Parnell's Soup Company. Okay, let me see this. With Juan dead, we need a new suspect, Cole. Is there a pattern to the deliveries? Tijuana. No. This guy EJ seems to be bringing in most of the serious weight. The dates and times seem pretty regular. <clears throat> we should notify the border crossing. Those fuckers are probably in on it. Let's wait and see how this plays out. Okay, I think that was everything. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, people. Was there anything else? No. Tomato soup from Tijuana does slap. <laughs> you know, I believe you. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Do I not need to call anymore? I guess not. I wasted my, uh, my time. Find anything interesting? Not really. Did we find everything? I guess I can, oh, nope, wrong button. Clues. Let's see, what do we have? Handwritten note in marijuana stash house. Sorry, this is the way they say it. In marijuana stash house, thank you. you catch all the good ones, Phelps. What else? How do I flip again? Oh, it's a trigger. Um, 1896 Morgan Silver Dollar with stamping mark. Okay. Parnell soup can sealed containing baggie of marijuana. Was it really? I guess I didn't see the bag. It looked like just like loose <laughs> in the can. What did, I just, what did I just hear? Is he moving around back there? Marijuana Stash House is the name of my band. Wait, to be honest with you, that does sound like it would be, like, a Midwest emo band. Is that- is that it? 50 pounds marijuana shipments coming regularly from Tijuana under name EJ. How regularly was it? I- I didn't actually look at the dates at all. Is that it? Do you think that's do you think that's uh all the clues that are in here? Wasn't there two dead bodies? Where's the other guy? Right? Wasn't he in this room? Oh, you know what? He's right there. Sorry, my fault. Let me go actually go out there and look at that body, I think. Girl, look at that body. Girl, look at that body. 
Oh, I can't look at the body. I guess I don't need to then. Did we get everything? He wouldn't he wouldn't go around the window. Sorry, my sister was talking to me. Um, sorry, this music is so eerie. <laughs> I think we've seen everything, though. Should I do one more look around here? Oh, I reckon. I reckon I might. I don't think... I think I got everything, though. I really don't want to miss any clues. I'm just like brushing against everything. I'm like, are you clickable? Okay, I, th I think that we can safely call that out. Um, I think we got everything in here too. Yeah. Listen, if we if we missed a clue in here, oh well. You know what I mean? Like this this ish happens. Can't be perfect. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm like, what else is there to do? I already found the soup weed. Where's my car? It's over here. All right. You, you drive this one. Parnell Fine. Soup Co. Factory. Headed? Nope, if there's if there's music, there's still things to find. Wait, is there music? The early bird gets the worm. The second mouse gets the cheese. Never the same, are they? Am I missing something? <laughs> Ej, what? Edward Jacob? <laughs> what did I miss? Go find Ej. I don't even know who Ej is. <laughs> Fun fact: Ej is what Bella from Twilight was going to call her baby, her vampire baby, if it was white. I remember this. something is this something oh you know what we didn't go in this room but i'm not even finding anything in here what the f y'all am i tripping Sorry, there's, there's, my, my family keeps talking in the background. Maybe we missed something outside. Would you name your son after your mistress? That's crazy. I don't know what I'm missing. Do you guys know? I can't look at this body if anybody's wondering. Maybe it's because we didn't call or we didn't use the phone when we could have. Maybe that's what we're missing, but it's too late for me. It's too late. I 
think I, I think I oopsie daisied. I'm trying to think what I've done. Because I could restart. I guess we would have to do this shootout and stuff all over again. You know, I'll just have to take that L, I suppose. Unless you guys think I should restart. I got friends who work at the examiner. How about five bucks for the exclusive? You're behind the wheel. We're just gonna have to take that out. Do we know L. where we're going? If it was a boy, do you think he still would have fallen in wolf love with the baby? What? Or is baby wolf love hetero only? Yes, and printing isn't gender specific. And he didn't fall in love. It, it's deeper than that, not necessarily romantic. Uh, maybe restart once. If it still can't find it, let it ride. Fair enough. Alright. You know a Freddy Calhoun? Sure, I know Freddy. Freddy needs money to get out of town. Says he's prepared to blow the whistle on a primo reefer distribution ring. Says he Has can... Has he said how much it's gonna cost? Fifty bucks. And the department will front me the fifty? You can put in an expense claim. He's over at Mike Lyman's on Hollywood Boulevard. See what you can find out. Okay. I say we bust in there and find the goddamn evidence. Nope, I'm already going the wrong way. Oh my goodness. Give me one second. Let me close my door. Okay, sorry. There was just a lot of noise happening in my background, and I'm like... I felt like I couldn't talk, and I'm like, ah, God damn it, let me, let me just shut the door. I don't have my fan on, so now it's, like, quiet. <laughs> 50 bucks? Do they think I'm made of money? I don't know, man. No, you just look like you're made of money. Oh, very good. The kid's on form. I'd say on a scale of dull to scintillating, you're a solid tedious today, which you can be pleased with. Do you ever listen to yourself? I don't have the same voices in my head as you do, Cole. Listen, man, I'm just I'm just trying to get to where I need to go. Oops. I want to make fun of you. You know you make it. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. You drive. Oh, we're going to miss uh, getting that, uh, whatchamacallit, that side quest that we did with the, with the gunman. We're going to have missed that, but, you know, it is what it is. I'm not too fussed. We did get EXP from it, but, eh, meh. I'm pretty sure that was that, right? Or was that the last case? I can't remember. I think that was that, the last case, actually. Never mind. You might just be good. Ah, I forgot about the bar part. It's fine. Speedrunning. There's a little sneak. That's him in the back, Cole. Yeah, I'm here. Freddy! You're looking good. You're gonna help. Right? Can't skip it. Sorry. That's what I'm here for. You got the money? The twenty? Just realized sure, who right that here. guy 20. sounds like. I Hades said, from you want the, the money Hercules or the alternative? Movie? Oh, my partner. Tell us about the reefer, Freddy. Who's he? Another did you read the Samaritan? Twilight books? You know, I question. did in fourth Quest grade. From Tijuana. I haven't read them since, though. They bring in They're on my bookshelves. I do want to read them. Fifty pounds? Are you hallucinating, Freddy? Get stashed at a house at 1452 North Las Palmas. Names, Freddy. The guy at the house is a spick that goes by the name Juan Garcia Cruz. No, not your partner, the other guy? Well, be careful. In what scene, guns. what other guy? Oh, the money. boss or whatever? Do me a favor, Freddy. Spend the money on a bus ticket. 
You can't last forever on a snitch jacket. Let's go visit this cruise character. 50 pounds of dope. Crazy. All wow, I did that too last time. What is the special of the day? Yeah, the lieutenant. <laughs> you can drive. Honestly, I already forgot what Where he sounded like. Do you think every morning Phelps like resharpens his little pencil? That's what I think. You believe his story? <laughs> sure. When he was talking about Vice, I was like, his what does sister he sound for like? his next score? <laughs> That box of pencils that we found in the house, um, Phelps is actually gonna keep that for himself. He's like, these are good pencils. And then if he opened it and it was drugs inside, he'd just be mad. He'd be like, what the hell? I thought I needed pencils. Sorry, I really like 11K calling KCPL. Officers need help. Wait, I think he's dead already. Shots fired in officers need help at 1452 North Las Palmas. <laughs> And that's how you do it. Roger, let me hear you. Before he could even call it in, bro. Okay, we're here. You guys don't have to leave a mess. What happened? Dope peddler, Juan Cruz. You open fire and, well, the rest of the story tells itself. Clean. I don't even know why I'm looking. Like, I don't, like, I don't know where the things are. Stop, Stop pissing me off. Juan Garcia Cruz. This is his address, but this place looks like a front. A silver dollar. I thought they took these things out of circulation. Nope. Well, not out of this guy's circulation. Drug or a village Mas in Borneo okay. doesn't appear to be in Spanish. Okay, we got this last time as well. Soup. Doesn't anyone eat regular meals anymore? Junkies feeding on popcorn and grasshoppers living on soup. Mmm. I don't want to look at the soup anymore. Okay, I'm gonna call. Look up me the soup. Uh, Operator, message address. for KGPL. Putting you through now. Cole Phelps, batch twelve forty-seven. How can I help, detective? I need an address on a Parnell Soup Company, a head office or factory in the Los Angeles area. Just a second, detective. Okay. Only one address listed. 6310 Fountain Avenue. Thanks for your help. Thanks. Okay, let's look over here. Gun. Which I think he said that was, this was Nothing not relevant. Significant. Do we ever see her face? Who? Oh, the the lady on the other line. I don't, I don't know. I doubt it. She's the unsung hero. That's like actually true, though. Oh, this. Wait, I missed this last time. What the fuck? These are the guys keeping Juan so well stocked with soup. Okay. Maybe this was what we were missing. Okay. <clears throat> Let's go to the kitchen now. 
got this. Which I don't think is anything. It's like when he taps, it's funny. You think that was just somebody who was working on the game's art and they were like, oh, can I just put this in as like a little Easter egg for me? Nope. Okay, let's go out to the shed. Yeah. Kick that shit in. I think it was this one. Oh no, I lied. It's this one. No, actually, I think it's... Is it this one? The flower one? Yeah, there we go. Now we're getting somewhere. What happened to the chickens? There just aren't any. They, this was to? probably from, like, the previous the tenant. <clears throat> Hungry or something, Phelps? Yeah. I'd say that's pretty good value for 12 cents. Factory sealed. Someone at the cannery has a lot of explaining to do. Oh, did chicken run? No time for chickens, only pot. <laughs> Aren't all the soup cans full of weed? They are, yes. Let me With Juan this. dead, we need a new suspect, Cole. Is there a pattern? This guy EJ seems to be bringing in most of the serious weight. The dates and times seem pretty regular. We should notify the border crossing. Those fuckers are probably in on it. Let's wait and see how this plays out. Hello. Oh my god, it's... <laughs> nails. What about this one? It's bolts. And what about this one? Jesus. Ha! Huh. Phelps, you jump like a girl. <laughs> Reward, you got scared, bro. That's you trying to play it off. <laughs> That actually kind of scared me. That made my like it, I didn't like jump, jump, but like you know my body twitched. <laughs> what if we brought our own can opener, bro? I would I would take some of those cans home. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'd be like, how are they gonna know? How are they gonna know? <laughs> like he's kind of cute though. Wait, what if I open it up again? He's cute. Bro said, ha, you jumped like a girl. You were more scared than me. Let's, let's, let's go. I think, is that, I think we got everything. I don't know, does this count as mu music still? Oops, no. This. I was saying, I think we, we have, like, the same things that we did last time. Hmm. 
I don't know. You haven't got the fanfare. <laughs> Did you ever get a pattern for the shipment dates? I think I we looked at the ledger. Not mean to do that. I think we got everything from this. Just, just padding everything. Two thousand dollars. Holy shit! I think we have everything in here. I can't think of anywhere else to look. You know, unless it's on the side of the house. I think we just gotta, we just gotta take it, you know? Is someone gonna tell us what the hell is going on? Can you drive to this one? Fine. Um, Where are we <clears throat> I think the, oh wait, oh yeah, we, 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 got, we got, we did get something new. The 20th century market. I'm still gonna go to Parnell's suit, but. Yes, I did look at the dead body. We couldn't look at the other one. We could only look at one. <clears throat> uh, but, yeah, uh, but yeah, the silver dollar was a clue because it had like an engraving on it that matched what we found on that pad of paper, I believe. Okay, let's go Parnell. Brother says the morphine is still turning up. Makes sense. We have no idea how much of the stuff Lenny shifted. There's been no comeback from Cohen as yet. Maybe Confidential Magazine is right, and Bugsy is on the slide. You read that stuff? I wouldn't say it to his face if I was you. That is one hot-tempered son of a bitch. Bro, I just remembered his name is Earl, I think. Our partner. I don't remember. I don't remember his last name, but I think his first name is Earl. Right. Let's see if we can find out who's been over seasoning the soup in this place. <laughs> you know, I bet you he stole some. Hi, how are LAPD. you, miss? Who owns this factory, ma'am? Mr. Parnell. Uh, Howard Parnell. I'll let him know you're here. Please, take a seat. If you don't mind, we'll come with you. If you must. You just wanted a follower, didn't you? You sly dog. Bro, it's so he doesn't get away. I apologize for my partner's roving eye. He hates saying goodbye, but he loves watching them leave. I fucking hate you. Give it a rest, Roy. Roy, you Roy. You show these men in to see Mr. Parnell, Doris? <clears throat> They're from the LAPD. Follow me, gentlemen. Okay. Okay, so are you gonna leave me or what, bro? What is going on? LAPD, sit tight, fatso. Whoa, you Jesus! Could be in very serious trouble. Like he does not need to say these things. There's no reason to be rude. Take a seat, gentlemen. I'm sure we can sort this all out. Maybe you can explain why we found five-dollar bags of marijuana in sealed Parnell soup cans. That's an outrageous allegation. How do you explain it, Chubby? We found at least thirty cans. Like he does not need to say this. It's crazy. It's crazy. Rory Earl. Listen, this is his problem. He's got two first names. 
for his first and last name. So you really could intertwine them, do whatever you want. It's like all the same. Literally, he's just an asset out of pocket for sure. I was like, I don't know if it if Earl's his first name or Roy. So I was like, I don't know. <laughs> Somebody else will know. So thank you, MF. <laughs> all sealed up tight with your label on him. Can I get a list of your employees? Of course. We have nothing to hide. Doris, can you bring me in the current employee listing? Here it is, Mr. Parnell. On the desk, please. Damn, bro. <laughs> Phelps is like, hello? <laughs> Any name on that list that rings a bell? I'm assuming it's the ones with like no fixed address because everyone else has an address. Okay, no. There's a, there's a, oh my god. There's another page. Out, oh, sap. How am I supposed to know? Like, is something actually supposed to stick out? Tijuana? Oh. Is there a Tijuana one? Oh, yeah, this one. Noah Nicholas Irving Ir Irvin Maybe we have to actually like I guess no Wait wait how do I go back Hello, am I not just- am I just not getting it, or...? Yeah, look for Edward Jake- oh yeah, you're right, EJ. <laughs> okay, keep your- guys, keep your eyes peeled out for EJ, bro. What if his name was just Edward Jacob? That'd be crazy. Can you flip the page, please? E... Stop interrupting my stream. I think I need to go back to the other page. Stop. Turn the page, please. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I'm not seeing any. Am, am I tripping? Am I tripping? You do see a Jacob? What page was that? Over here. Look for J's and then maybe a name that could be shortened to an E first name. This is familiar. Oh. 1452 North Los Palmas, a Jorge Garcia Cruz. I forgot about that guy. Oh, okay, we're asking him stuff. Um, okay. 
Factory sealed soup cans. The factory sealed cans we found suggest a very professional operation, Mr. Parnell. We're looking for an inside man. I know nothing about this. I want this stopped as much as you do. Um... I don't know, how do we feel about this? Remember, don't escalate and accuse him of assaulting little boys. Listen, Phelps is gonna do whatever he wants. <laughs> no, Elton John. <laughs> um, I don't know, I just feel like he's capping. I'm gonna Tell doubt. me what I wanna know, Parnell, or I will have half the LAPD down here tearing this place apart. You're hiding something. Am I right in thinking you would not wanna pursue misdemeanors outside your drug case? Depending on what you call a misdemeanor, we might be prepared to turn a blind eye. The truth is, I employ a lot of illegals. No one wants to do menial work anymore. Most of my factory staff are wetbacks. The local blacks and Chicanos all want jobs in aircraft factories. Presumably because the pay is a lot better. How are your sales, Mr. Parnell? Just fine and dandy, son. We're entering a new era of prosperity. I hope you're both big soup eaters. Now, do you mean real soup or, you know, the special soup? I just feel like everything you say is a, is a, is a sus doubt. Mr. Parnell, do you know what kind of trouble you're in? Come clean with us. Okay, so things are a little flat. We're deciding whether to lower production. It's taken a while to adjust to not having any military contracts. You know, we sold Uncle Sam... Five million cans of minestrone. Knowledge of Cruz brothers. Ever heard of Juan Garcia Cruz? Not that I know of. He has a brother employed here. You know him? We employ large numbers of Mexicans. I I'm not familiar with them all. You already know what I'm about to do, so. That's funny, Parnell. He has the same address as his brother Juan, who we shot dead less than an hour ago. You better give me something. Look, I'm not involved in this. I'm getting enough grief from Washington. There's an investigation going on into profiteering, like a guy shouldn't be able to turn a buck while the war is on. I'm sure thousands of dead Marines sleep soundly knowing that you did okay. Ooh, inside man, Jorge. Tell us about Jorge Garcia Cruz. Jorge? I had no idea of his last name. His team does daily maintenance on the conveyor belts and cookers. Um, that I do believe is the truth. I don't think so he was here now? about that. No, maintenance is at night. Uh, night shift finishes around midnight. He would usually come in around 9 p.m. and have everything ready for the morning shift at 6. We'd like to take Let's a look around the factory go. floor, Let's Mr. Parnell. Go. I hope we won't have to shut down the line. No, nothing like that. Thank you. I'm grateful for that. I'll show you around myself. Period. Let's go. Hey, that's not good. I seeing how things are made. This is going to be like that time I went to the slaughterhouse and couldn't eat steak for a week. Nothing like the taste of minestrone in war. Ah, the door. This is where the produce comes in. We peel and sort all of the vegetables okay. and add them to the line in regular quantities. Fascinating. Let me look at this. Wow. Why don't you keep quiet? You might learn something. Oh, good God. This really is turning into some nightmare school trip flashback. Wow, that sure looks like a beauty. This is the hopper, which boils and purees the vegetables. The other hopper is for the pasta. This way, please. 
You're loving this, aren't you, Phelps? It's educational. The soup is ladled automatically into cans. Next stage is labeling. I'd like to see the packing and dispatch area, if you don't mind. Sure. It's over here. Follow me. This is one of our dispatchers. Sergio, right? Yes, sir. These men are from the <laughs> LAPD. Sergio here records our outgoing deliveries. They all go in the book. Just there, on the desk. We're looking for repeat business in large amounts, Cole. What's going on, Parnell? There's enough soup going to this place every day to feed a company of Marines. What are you talking about? <laughs> Can I have a look at that coin? Sure, why not? <gasps> Silver dollar, right? Yeah, that's right. The markings on it say it's been taken out of circulation. Maybe. I'm not trying to buy anything with it. I like it. Brings me luck. It has the more engravings on it. <clears throat> no longer in circulation. Uh, factory sealed soup cans. Do you have access to the canning area? I do. But I keep to my station. Loading and unloading. Don't care much for soup. You're looking shifty, bro. Doubt. You're doubt. <laughs> Sergio, if you don't give me something, I'm gonna go to immigration services and have you deported. I get a shipment once every two weeks. Ernesto does the driving. I don't know his full name. It's delivered here at night. Jorge gets it canned up. From here, it gets sent all over the country. 20th century market. What do you know about the 20th century market? Nada. I get the orders from upstairs. I send the goods where I'm told. And you don't know Juan Garcia Cruz? No, not me. Okay, well, why do you have, like, the same silver dollar that matches his? Where do you add the weed, for real? So where is the step where the weed is injected into the soup? Well, yeah, when do they take the soup out? Or, well, he said he comes in at night, so I guess maybe he sets it up differently at night. To dispense weed instead of soup. <laughs> I'm gonna say... Wait, let me look at my notebook. Okay, I do have a silver dollar. See? It matches. Okay, lie. You're a liar, Sergio. <clears throat> You're in it, and I'm gonna break you for it. You're loco, Placa. I got nothing to do with Juan Garcia. Okay, we'll explain this then. We found a matching silver dollar on Juan Garcia. What are the odds of that, Sergio? Juan and Jorge are in brothers. They're cousins. They work for some evil gabacho. The guy is an aberration. He gives out the silver dollars. Jorge gets me a list of deliveries every morning. 20th century is always on me. You keep your mouth shut for today and I don't take you in. Do we have a deal? Do I have a choice? Is that a serious question? That's it for now, Sergio. If we need to speak to you again, we'll put in a call to Mr. Parnell. If you have to, I guess. We will be in touch, Mr. Parnell. It is imperative that things appear as normal here. Keep an eye on Sergio in case he gets tempted to blow the whistle. Thanks, I'll do that. You're going to overlook my little immigration problem, aren't you? Cheer up, fatso. We're gonna let you go on squeezing these poor saps a little while longer. Well, 
until some commie union types infiltrate this place. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's I go. I'm glad to be out of that place. I never knew fresh vegetables could smell so bad. I feel like it's in my clothes. Alright, I guess now we're going to 20th century, baby. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, you, you know the way. More. You can drive. Do we know where we're going? Oh. Am I Is there something in there? Is there something in there? It's not crossed off. Hey, you don't mind if I just come in here real quick? Oh, damn it, they trapped me. This is huge. How am I supposed to know what I, what I need to look for? For their little vegetables. Sorry. <laughs> oh, hey, man. Nope. Okay, nothing over here. Here. I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to check this whole building. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you know, I've done I've done well everywhere else. I'll take an L here. That's fine. That's fine, in it. No, but this time you 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 are actually driving. This is not on me. You drive. I need to go over the case. I want someone to go in that big soup barrel. That is, that's gonna be crazy. All right, where to? Here. I want soup. Just like a can of Progresso. That'd be fine. Oh my god, you did not need to leap over that. That was so extra. Get in the car. How many years have you been in the maze all over again? No. <laughs> More years than I want to own up to, Phelps. You have any idea who Rojas was talking about? The gringo runs the operation? Could be anybody. You don't expect those morons to be running the show, do you? You ask Roas how much a silver dollar is worth, he'd probably say 50 cents. Alright, we're here. <clears throat> Sit tight. Let's take a look at what's going on. Okay, let me take a look. The highest quality, standard in, huge saving all day. Either these customers are serious soup lovers, or I think we found our middleman. Car 11 King to KGPL. Car 11 King, go ahead. Oh my God, I'm requesting assistance in a B wagon at 20th Century Markets, 1558 North Highland. Numerous narcotic suspects. Code 2 only, no sirens. 11K, Roger. Okay. <laughs> Cavalry should be here any minute. Okay. 
Oh, here they come. LAPD, nobody move! I'll take my chances. That's crazy. Come here, bitch. Yo, I'm like a predator. <laughs> I'm like a fucking lion, bro. Whatever you're carrying, hand it over. I'd say he's got about half a can left. I guess that makes me a pessimist. You can't take me in. Take you in? Be glad he didn't shoot you. I wouldn't have chased it's you. It's true. If it was up to me, you'd be talking out of a hole in the back of your I head. I want information. Senor, I would like to help you, but I got a family in Mexico I have to provide for. And my compadres are very unreasonable. Your compadres? Turn out your pockets. Officer, I need Ray to run down these silver dollars. I need to make a deal. I need guarantees. You have identification? Sanchez Erto, Mexican, Tijuana address. Here's the deal, Erto. You give me information, and I won't give you to immigration. Not the rhyming. Knowledge of EJ, who give the me fuck EJ, is that? The driver bringing in the shipments, or I'll make you for it. I run the shop. That's all I do. Okay, well, that's like capping, because... Tell me the goddamn truth. You are in this with you the have others. the coin. I told bro. you I know them. I told you my family's at risk. What makes me part of their gang? The dollar, bro, the dollar. You have a silver dollar, Erto, just like Juan. I'm sure Ernesto and the rest have them as well. The silver dollars are his mark. Whose? Give me a name. None of us are allowed to see him. His creatures carry his orders to us. If I gave you his name, I would be buried alongside my wife and children. If you don't give us something, you will rot in jail while your family starves on the street. Ernesto Juarez, tonight at 1 a.m. He's bringing the truck into the soup factory. Please help me, sir. Ernesto can be very cruel. Tell me about the soup cans. The soup is very popular, as you can see. Bro, look at that smug ass look on his face. No. Real funny, wise guy. You want to try saying that again with no teeth? I get a delivery at 7.30 every other day from the factory. Jorge organizes everything. Why is he mewing in the picture? Help. I don't know. We know about Jorge and Juan. Juan is dead. Tell us how you know the Cruz boys. Ernesto put together this thing. He brought in Juan, Juan brought in Jorge. Hmm. He looks pretty normal. Not smugly he was before. Okay, okay, I'll believe you. Continue. I was already here. Ernesto knows I'm illegal, so he threatened to report me if I didn't help. And the money is good. The gringos and the gringas, they love the reefer. And I didn't want to have to leave and start again in San Francisco. You're breaking my heart. You're under arrest, Erto. I'll speak to the DA and see if he will agree to not seize your assets or deport you. That's the best I can do.
Look over here. We're here. Freddy said they were moving 50 pounds a week. That's a lot of soup cans. I think this is an interstate operation. Moving dope around the country to selected grasshoppers. Local weed gets distributed in the usual way, through Pachuco street punks. Someone must know something about this drug baron character. Here they come. Oh, Lord. Oh, I feel like this is not going to end well. Like, what are we supposed to do? Let them unload the goods first. I th am I going to have to do a car now, chase? Let's get them. No! Oh, bro. Open your eyes! A quickie thing to the shop. Oops, sorry. This is fine. This is amazing parking, actually. Girl, I don't know what what any of these are. Sure, this one. Damn, bro. Am I, am, I, am, I, am I about to get into like a big fight? Do I have any anything good? Please? Like, I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't th Hit harder, take more punches, but we're in a fight, a gunfight. Shoot shader with a Thompson bar and shotgun, maybe? I don't know. I don't even know what gun I have, to be honest. <laughs> I haven't unlocked, like, a new outfit in ages. And I don't know when I'm going to get a new one. I actually hate this one. That This one's ugly. Alright, uh, bro. Let's go, I guess. All right, move. Move! Let's go! Everyone into position. Okay, gentlemen, we'll take the lead. You cover us. Wait, where are we going? Got your back. In here? LAPD, put your hands where we can see them. Go, Phelps, get in there. Throw out the guns. I don't even know where they're shooting from. Oh my god, there's already officers down. Where are they shooting from? Am I getting hit right now? Give me some cover. You're covered, Phelps. Oh, God. Oh. Ow. Hey, okay, there's that guy. I still don't know where the other person is. Somewhere over here? I'm wide open he here. Oh, hey. Find some cover. Oh, he's right there. Real clever asshole. I'm going to find you. I need him to poke out this window. Clear me 
need some space here. Stay in cover. Who are you shooting at? Oh, right there. How about? I'm wide open here. That's my partner. I almost just shot him. Yes, All clear. I think that's the last of them, Cole. Oh, why you say it like that? <laughs> like we could have had such a good relationship if he if he wasn't the way he was. I hate it. Detectives. Found something here you probably want to see. Dude, I lost my hat, bro. Is this my hat? Oh, thank God. Got that back. I could have been hatless. That would have been bad. One dollar per dead man. Doesn't seem like much for a human life. you want to address, we should see what the Federales have on him. What is this? I mean, could I, was there anything it, with this? He didn't say anything. So I guess not. I guess I'm done. <laughs> Put that back. <laughs> You're good, bro. Um, was that it? God damn. I think we found our stash, Cole. Huh? Take a look in these boxes. Huh? Let me look. Oh my god. At the very minimum, this shit looks like pounds. broccoli. Detectives! I think we got the guy. Does the name Cruz mean something to you? It certainly does. Well, oh, okay. Do I follow you? I'm assuming since you looked back, yeah, the answer is yes. Ah, stop. Did he go up? Oh, he did. Oh, but he's dead. What the fuck is he holding, though? Girl, what? <laughs> Bro, that's a lot of dough. That's mine. Must be a thousand dollars here. Another one. Yet another silver dollar. Phelps, Earl. Looks 
like quite a bloodbath. What was this all about? Drugs and money. What else? Speaking of money, where did that roll go? I picked it up for safekeeping. Oh my the God. department owes me 50. Ray, I have another <laughs> two coins right. for you. Great. I've got something to show you. It's all set up on the table over here. There. Take a look at these coins you've been collecting. Listen, I would have done the same thing. I'm not even going to lie. That looks like a Tommy gun. I believe you. There are letters cut into each coin, okay. along with not legal tender. What does it mean? Those are Morgan silver dollars from the 20s. They were removed from circulation and sent for disposal. A number of smelters around the country had the contract. Look at them together. Can you work out what it says? Um. Can I move them? Oh, I can. Okay. Wait, hold on. No! Put that back. I want this one. Here we go. The first coin, M-A-S. The second, A-N-G. The third, K-A-Y. The fourth, M-E-T. The fifth, A-L-S. Mesanke Metals. A metal foundry. Would you like the address? Yes. Would I ever? Would 1034 I? Vine Street, Hollywood. We'll finish up here. It's already been a long night, Phelps. See if you can talk them into giving themselves up. <clears throat> All right, well, is that, uh, is that everything, Pookie? Um. How do I, how, damn, bro, he's leaving me. How do I get out of here? Wait. Wait, he's leaving me. Where did he go? Damn, is he already at the car? Damn, bro. Damn, bro. You can drive. Yeah, Fine. so slide to that driver's seat. Masang Metals. <clears throat> I hope that big wad of cash doesn't weigh you down. Get your priorities straight, Phelps. We're close to bringing in one of the biggest dope cases of the year, and you're worrying about unsubstantial evidence? <laughs> Period. Loki, he's gonna write. Locked. We need another way in. Why'd you park like this? Any ideas? So how do we get in? Check around the back. Okay. Want to take out my guns again? Wait. Get him on the back, girl. Where? This way. Oh. Oh. <laughs> My game crashed. <laughs> Oops. Um. Oopsie daisy. I hope it saved at some point. <laughs> um. They did not like me going into that corner, I guess. They said, uh, you're done. You're done. And I'm like, what do, what do you mean? This game relies on auto saves, by the way. So. 
I don't even know when it last auto saved. <laughs> I'm waiting. I'm waiting for my game to open. Question mark. Oh, this is this is y'all's first time seeing this because I usually do that you this happens before I start streaming Hold on, I gotta, I gotta do this real quick. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> on my, it might look full screen on your end, but on my end it was not full screen, and I have to do that to make it full screen. <laughs> okay, we're, we're on Reefer Madness still. I hope it's not too far back. Okay, this is not too bad. Okay, we're right here. This is fine. Okay. Okay, I'm staying away from that corner. That corner's dangerous, man. Wait, how the F do we get in here? I think we have to go all the way around. See that, like, skinny path? I think we have to go there. <clears throat> like, when they said like go around, they meant around. I mean, oh, sorry, ma'am. Right here, right here, right here. I'm out of here. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> I don't know. <clears throat> um, Roy, what the F are we doing? I'm trying to look for something I can climb. Shut up. doing bro what am I doing what is this I feel like I'm in a horror game low key Roy I'm scared oh man I don't know what I'm doing. Oh no. Where, where am, what am I doing, bro? <gasps> Shit. Okay, wait, wait, wait. 
Wasn't it? Where, where, where is the back of the building? Let me look. Let me look. Let me in. Let me in. That's the guy. I heard he's an honest cop. <laughs> Wait, can I climb this? Oh, that's an for you. Can I do something from up here? <gasps> oh, wait, 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 look, 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 look. Wait, are we in? Are we in? Wait, are we in? <gasps> Dude, we're in. Okay, wait, now we have to get in this part. Back door, right? God damn it! You win one more hand, Andy. I'm taking my money and going home. And fuck who's turn it into mine shop. Hey, what can I say? I got lucky. Oh, hey, who the fuck is that? Find some cover! You're clear, go! You're wait, wait, what did he climb? What the fuck? Oh, shit. Really hurts. Move, I've got you. Are you trying to get yourself killed? What do you mean? Where? I don't know where. Where do I have to go down? You're above me. Get behind something, Phelps! Don't 
behind what, bro? I don't even know where the enemies are. Are there enemies? Where are you? Take oh. cover, you lunatic! What? Who's here? Space here. W like where? Where? What's happening? There's nothing going on, bro. <laughs> um. Um. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Is my game bugged? Maybe I need to kick open this door over here. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, sorry. PD, hands up! Victor Sanders. You know this guy? I should have known. Of course I know Roy. Roy and I have had an arrangement for Get many up. years. You're under arrest. Am I? We have a mountain of prima facie evidence, as well as the testimony. You'd be surprised how things have a habit of sorting themselves out. Evidence disappearing. Witnesses that can't be found. Policemen that forget. The impossible becomes probable when you have a client list like mine. Shut your mouth! Turn around and put your hands behind your back! Working vice can be a thankless task, Phelps. But on behalf of the brass and the moms and dads and the concerned citizens, I'd like to commend you and your partner for smashing this dope ring. Reefer is almost as big a threat to the children of this city as communism. What about Sanders, Lieutenant? <laughs> as communism. Leave it's Sanders so, to so me, Phelps. So fucking goofy. The chief will be looking after that one. Person. He will be brought to trial. Phelps, we are celebrating your success. Don't push your luck. Sanders is no longer your problem. Let's go. There was no car chase, so I didn't had I didn't do any damage to the city. Meanwhile, Your platoon is what remains of recon. I'm folding you into the 22nd. You'll be going up that damn hill tonight. We're intelligence gathering, sir. I don't need intelligence, son. I need men who can hold rifles and kill Japs. Tonight, you're a rifle company. We've got cooks, mechanics, and stretcher bearers all going into the line. We aim to break them tonight, Lieutenant. Good to see you, Hank. You too, Cole. How's your war? Not quite what I expected. As long as I live, I will never get over that sound. Hey, who's that medic? He'll be killed going out there. It's Sheldon, the guy from the Alcacala Bridge. That guy's got no fear. <laughs> didn't make it. I didn't go out there to save him. What are you saying, man? I went out there to put him out of his misery, to ease his pain. Do you have a problem with that? Murder, Corman. That's war, Lieutenant. Smell the stench. Feel the horse breath on your neck. You need help, man. Call for me tonight, Lieutenant. When you're up on that hill. I've been up there three times already. The circles of hell have nothing 
on Sugarloaf Hill. Get this madman out of my sight! I don't... Is that the fucking, uh... Weird student guy? That we've been seeing in the newspapers? The setup... <gasps> Who was getting set up, though? American Legion Boxing Stadium? You like the fight game, Phelps? I did a little boxing in the Marines. I found it a pretty humbling experience. I can't lie, this city is very pretty. Like, the, just the old schoolness of everything. It's nice. Fix your sandwich, buddy. Corned beef and egg salad, 12 cents. Bologna and ham and cheese, 10. It's strictly a mugs game. You'll like this fight, though. A plucky limey's about to take a beating from an up-and-coming Negro. You sound pretty sure about the result. I ought to be. I got 50 bucks on the black kid. <laughs> Let's get a ringside seat. Son of a bitch Hammond made a run for his dressing room. Let's find out what's going on. God damn you, Albert! You get out here right now! Step back, LAPD. What's going on? That son of a bitch Hammond has jammed the door. And who are you? Carlo Arcaro. I'm his manager. I'm his trainer. Interesting attitude to have towards a victorious athlete. Victorious? We had an arrangement. We had a goddamn arrangement! That limey bastard was paid to take a nap. He reneged. And you were out of pocket? Damn right. Me and a couple of hundred other people. Stand aside. He squeezed out the window. I'll put an APB out on him. Why would we do that? He won the fight fair and square. To prevent him from getting clipped. He was paid to flop. There was big money riding on this So are we fight. here because you lost money or because we're investigating a prize fighting racket? Very funny. Look around and see what you can find. Which is Hammond's locker? Over by the pin board, second from the end. Like I'm gonna remember what the fuck you just said. Okay, what do we got in here? We got some tape that I know means nothing. And an obvious note that does mean something. There's a phone number we can run by R&I. Plus a bunch of names and odds. You're not the only one who likes a flutter, Roy. Seems irrelevant. Girl, don't follow me into the showers. Let's get get out of here. Looked over your right. Oh, I need to make a call. Wait, what about this? <gasps> Give me this. Yes. You look troubled. Yeah, I'm it's in him. A jam, doctor. Can I help, Courtney? Is it money? No, no, doctor. That's okay. Do I have your professional confidence? Whatever you say. We'll never leave this room. I told
talk some of the guys in my old unit into doing something, and it's gone wrong. I guess I did it for the wrong reasons, for short-term gain. We came home from China on the Cool Bridge. The morphine robbery. That was us. I thought I could get the guys a fair share. Some sort of benefit for the sacrifices that they made in the war. Those guys deserve it, Doctor. Oh, I'm sure they do, Courtney. But the deserving aren't always rewarded. Tell me about it, Doc. Uh, we shifted our stuff onto this mob-connected guy, and it's been turning up all over town. It wasn't meant to be like this. The presumption was rather naive, Courtney. I know that now, Doctor. But people are dying. Hmm. Might I venture a few questions? Sure. Do your underworld contacts have all the morphine? No, they don't. We doled it out, hoping we could control it. Are they pressing you for further allocation? That's the polite way of putting it, Doctor. I may be able to help you, Courtney. Thanks, Doc. It helps just to talk about it. I mean, I have a solution that will help you financially and salve your conscience. I'm all ears, Doctor. I will transact to take all the narcotic off your hands. Rest assured that it will all be medically administered. I will use the funds that I no longer require for the purchase of medication and invest them. I in swear to where their next work is so weird. No, 100%. Housing? The developments in question are housing projects for former servicemen. Your return will come from the sale of the properties, and your investment will benefit those that you care for most. Does this arrangement meet with your approval? You're a magician, Doctor. Wow. Okay, we got eight out of thirteen. Um what what Okay, great enough something that doesn't matter. Oh, good to me. Okay, where is the phone? Woo beach. You better find that cocksucker and you bring him to me. I feel bad too, Mickey. He guaranteed me he would take the flop. I guarantee that you will be fish food if you don't bring me... Roy, you out of pocket too? Mickey, seems that way. Don't worry about it. My boys are out looking for him. Well, you'd better call them off. This is a police matter now. If anything happens to Hammond, I'll testify that you made threats against him. Who's the Greyhound? He's a frisky one, isn't he? Cole Phelps? Mickey Cohen. I know who he is, Roy. I, uh, met his brother-in-law. Oh. Ooh, Phelps. I think you had the mixture pretty scared back there. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Cole Phelps, badge 1247. How could I help, Detective? I need an address for the following phone number. AL345. The address for the phone number is... The Hotel El Mar, 6294 Leland Way, Hollywood. Thank you. You know the place? Flop house. Quarter a night, no questions asked. Oh, yes. Oh, look at her. We got our little parking spot over here. Oh, yes. 
You drive. I need to go over the case notes. I need to go over the case All right, notes. All right, where to? Uh, just here. You seem to have a pretty cozy relationship with Cohen and Stampanato. Do I note a hint of reprimand in your tone, detective? Talking to gangsters comes with the turf. You should try out Mickey's place. He's got a haberdasher's up on Sunset. Bro, it's like the most clean cop. With See if he can get you out of those cop. old man's clothes that you slink around in. It's a front for his illegal activities. It is that, but he does carry some very sharp suits. If it's okay with you, I'll stick with Brooks Brothers. I want to go buy suits. How do we do that? <laughs> Can we do that? Hotel El Mar. Cheap rates, hot water. Fair enough. Let me see this map real quick. Boxing stadium, and we're about to go. Can you zoom in more? No? Eh? I don't know what yellow dot we're on. I, w I, want, I want to go suit shopping. You can't just like dangle that in front of me. Dude, we're actually really far away. Whoa. Guys, did you know California big? LA actually kind of big? The gun, the gun, the gun, the gun. I'm so sorry I keep saying that. It's just too bad. Okay, let's go. Hello. Talking. Yeah, what do you want? Intelligent. Yeah, what do you want me? We're making inquiries into the whereabouts of an Albert Hammond. No one here by that name. You sure? Sure, I'm sure. This isn't the sort of place where people use their real names. Take a look at the register if you don't believe me. Has that just been paid look about him? Let I me swear, see. This town is going straight to hell. Okay, so look for prominent Tommies. That should narrow it down. Prominent Tommies? What does that mean? Uh, you got a problem? How? This town's dangerous. Should I look for people who, like, come here a lot? One of these days. I don't, I don't, am I, is anybody seeing anything? Oh. That's that cop. Seems like a decent guy. I don't know what I'm looking for either. Me just hoping maybe I'll tap on it randomly. I just see the names of a bunch of famous people, really. <laughs> Dude, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I can't, surely I can't just tap on them, all of them. Please. You look for the boxer, right? Honestly, I don't, I don't actually even know what we're doing. I'm just going where they're telling me to. I think so, though. 
they said something about Tommy's, and I'm like, what? Someday you'll say something intelligent. <laughs> Not Marilyn Monroe. Winston Churchill. Winston Churchill. A very patriotic Englishman is staying in room 207. We got Good it. Old bulldog. Even at a flop house, Adley can't get out from his shadow. Has that just been paid look about him? We did it. And it only took I just tapping on everything. Going straight to hell. She wants a five star goddamn wedding. Door's unlocked. Looks like he's had a broad up here. You're a real asshole. You know that? He must be heading home. You know, I hope he makes it. That crooked son of a bitch, no chance. Wait, let me make sure there's not anything on the back. Or if I could turn it. Okay, no. There's just a bunch of flies in my face. Because I'm standing by the trash. What is this? Okay, let's look at this first. I guess a fighter has plenty of time on his hands between bouts. Does Albert have somebody special? I didn't see anyone in his corner at the fight. Damn, bro, maybe the Valentine's Day chocolate was just on sale. Is that too much? I think that's it. Is this meth? Meth? It's still warm. Like Albert has been doing some homework. Eleven grand would be a nice little nest egg. Gives us angle if he has a real love interest. There's lipstick on the cigarette, but this is the first time we've ever picked up a cigarette button and it's actually been useful. So, round of applause for that. Oh, I almost missed this. What the fuck? Don't think this is anything. Damn. Okay, I think... Don't know wait. Another window exit. Must have just missed him. Oh, here we go. Instaheat. Adrian Black's product of choice. <gasps> Seems Arnold like a soup. lifetime ago. your dreams candy has expensive taste albert has his work cut out for him who's candy candy edwards the lady who filled out this coupon all right let's go after his girl see if that gets us any closer um okay let's go then 
Hey, do you know anything? I think someone's had a few too many. What? What? Bruh. This town's dangerous. Are you coming? A girl. Girl. Girl, are you serious? He, why is he running? Just two seconds ago, I was waiting for him to come out. You're such a dick. Can you drive to this one? Fine, where are we headed? Ooh, where should we go first? What do we think? Should we just go down the list? That's kind of what I just tend to do, so I guess we'll go Hotel Elmar. This is the place. Wait, I'm sorry, what? What? I swear, this town is going straight to hell. Has that just been paid look about him? Wait, we went here already. What? Uh, you got a problem? How? Oh, wait. What? Did we not find everything we needed here? One of these days. Why isn't it crossed off then? You can say something. Oh Do no, now know it's circled, going? bruh. Bruh. Circle it again. <laughs> the way you have to run around. So, you boxed in the Marines? We Here all we did. Go. Standard training. I can't imagine you ever played dirty. The only prize for taking a fall was a thousand push ups. We need to know which room is Candy's. What I missed. Does America kind of understand about giving much money? Okay. Let's uh, go inside. Hello. Can I help you, gentlemen? Tell them a bunch of LAPD, ma'am. We're looking for Candy Edwards. Apartment 7. You take the outside stairs by the parking lot and turn left at the top. You friends of the Italian guy? Italian guy? Yeah. Sleazy type? Gave his name as Carlo. I didn't like the look of him, but Candy has some funny friends. Thanks. This Candy broad must be as sweet as she sounds. All these gentlemen callers. Someone gonna tell us what the hell is going on? No. Give it up, bitch. Sounds like we're missing he's all the fun. Get in there, Phelps. You know where he's hiding. Now tell me where he is before I cut you. I told you I haven't. LAPD. Like hitting women, do you? We had a goddamn. This isn't gonna end well for these friends. Yeah, you like hitting women, huh? Not my house. I respect women. I drink my respect women juice. Got him. Wait, is he? Oh, wait. Cold, Unconscious body. I was Give like, he he's around. dead. My fist killed him. Jeez. But he's alive. He's just, uh, he's just deep in. I always check the arms and stuff, even though they usually don't have anything. Just in case the one time I don't check, it's a clue. <laughs> Alright, what's in here? 
George Ray Carlo Wallace Mervyn Harry Robert. What are the odds on them all being bookmakers? Convenient, that's the only thing written in there. <gasps> Switch blade. Nasty weapon. All the Italians carry them. A real man uses his fists or a gun. <laughs> I guess so. Oof. Alright, I'll look at this stuff then. Let's look at this. Scania sails from New York. Single ticket, one way. I guess there isn't a lot for Albert in Ohio. Mm. Take a seat, Miss Edwards. We have some questions for you to answer. Look, I haven't done anything wrong. Ever? I find that pretty hard to believe. I find that hard to believe. Can you answer some questions now, Miss Edwards? Sure, I've had worse. I'll shake it off. All right. Whereabouts of Hammond? <laughs> what does that mean? We're trying to track down Albert Hammond. We have reason to believe he might be in danger. Do you know where he is? No, I don't. I'm over Albert. I haven't seen him. Okay, well, she's definitely looking shifty. What clues do I even have? I actually don't know. <laughs> okay, so we have bookmaker's odds. Telegram. Movie ticket stub. Bookmakers payouts. Ow. Magazine. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Your name is on here. Okay, yeah, so you're lying. You're lying, Candy. You were in his hotel room. He came back after the fight and you weren't there. What happened? You can't prove that I was in the room. Okay, so what's this then, bro? How do you think we found you, Candy? You wrote your name and address on a coupon. Look, coupon. Albert was supposed to take a coupon. fall. We were all supposed to make a little money out of it. But Albert got too goddamn stubborn. Said his pride was all he had left. So I told him, shove it. Let's see his pride keep him warm at night. So you walked out before the fight? Yes, I did. What's the problem? I didn't take anything. List of the odds Harry, recovered. Did Mervyn or Ray mean anything to you? Could be anybody. How the hell would I know? Okay, you're looking sus again, and we had like the, the bookmaker shit. They're bookmakers, aren't they? Tell me the truth. How the hell would I know? Albert wrote this his one. winnings down on a notepad in the hotel room. We found the odds in his locker. Who has the betting slips? That son of a bitch, Albert. Everyone thought he was dumb, including me, but he beat them all. Plans to leave You're town. Leaving town, Miss Edwards? Yes, I'm going straight home. Okay, why is no he's not? She's like <laughs> So I don't think she's lying, but I'm definitely doubting her. Albert is going home by boat as soon as he collects his you know, winnings. I know you're going to I was at that point. Albert yeah. is going I'm to collect stupid. nothing. Oh, I was lucky you can get out of town in one piece. How will you fare any better? They already believe you're in on it. Hell, I know you're in on it. You can think what you want, Buster. I'll take my chances. I got a few errands to run, and then I say adios to this dump. Do you want to press charges against Arcaro? Just get him out of here. That's all I want. Get out, Carlo, you hump. And get rid of that pig sticker. You ever pull that thing on me, I'll shoot you like a dog. That bitch knows where Hammond is. She knows where my money's gone. My money, too, tough guy. I'll handle this. Good luck, Miss Edwards. I hope things work out for you. Thank you. It's very kind of you to say so. 
Bad people are looking to hurt Candy, and yet she's not heading straight for the train station? I smell a payoff. I say stake her out. See where she goes. Yeah, just say that very loudly outside her door. Why not? Like you're Tail literally in plain sight. Don't let her get away, but don't no, get spotted. Please. I'll bring up the car behind you. Okay, 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 okay. I get to run. Not the. the oh my god. Listen, I saw her turn around. <laughs> oh, God damn it. Okay, 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 okay. How do I go incognito? Turn and I have coffee. Oh, welcome back. Press A to go incognito. Oh. Losing the trail. Too much slack. Gotta get closer. Move in. At risk losing the trail. Are you serious? Bro, please. This is gonna take fucking forever. Holy shit. Oh, wait. Okay, search him here. Slack. Gotta get closer.
Move in. Can't risk losing the trail. For oh, fuck's sake. She's just so happy to turn around. I'm so sorry. Okay, okay, it's not too- it's not too bad, I think. I'm sorry, I'm like locked in, bro. Oh, Jesus Christ. Krills. Bookmakers? Yes. Surprise, surprise. Why do we even get out of in the car? Oh no, that's uh, that is a meat shop. Wait, am I supposed to be going into one of these places? A blonde woman just came in here. She went out the back way. Said she was being watched. How much did she collect? Thirty-six hundred dollars. She cleaned me out. On the Hammond Kid Galahad fight? You got it. I'm not complaining. We all made a lot of money on that one. Huge plunge on Galahad, and then Hammond knocks the bum out. So she collected the money and went out through the back door. Nope. She made a phone call over there, wrote something on a notepad, and then left. Okay, okay. I'm just glad we don't have to tail her anymore. Well, actually, we might have to, but I don't know. No good, Cole. She's gone. Trail's cold. Fuck. There must be something inside that can give us a lead. What are you doing? An old intelligence trick from the Marines. Examiner. 
Okay, wait, where's the car? It's, it's out front, right? I'm assuming. You're driving, you're driving, bro. You're driving. Don't even play me right now. You know the way. You can drive. Where are we going? Hammond backed himself to win. And Candy is picking up the winnings. Smart play. Question is, is Candy collecting on Albert's behalf, or is she cheating him too? Car 11K, 11 King. Further to your request, Bunko Fraud has three known bookmakers operating out of storefronts in the Hollywood area. Thrifty Liquor, 6106 Santa Monica, the Examiner Drugstore, and a Max Spirits at 1658 North Cherokee. KGPL clear. What are we going to see today? That cherry pie was deep. Detectives Hello. Phelps and Earl, LAPD. Relax, Cole. You just have a blonde in here, Mervyn. Okay, Marvin. so it is Roy sure did. You were right. I'm just about to close up. Ew. She took me to the cleaners. 4,000 clams and change. How long ago did she leave? Maybe five minutes. Called the cab. Asked for a number. I told her there was a card over there by the phone. Yellow cap. We need to get after her fast. How fast, bro? Operator, give me dispatch. Can you connect me to the Yellow Cab Company, Hollywood 2187, please? This is Detective Phelps, LAPD. You dispatched a cab to 1487 Ivar Avenue, Hollywood? Yes, sir. Send one round from the pool. Do you have the number of that cab? Number 179. Thanks. We're done playing around. Get Mervyn to give us an address on Ray's place. Hello. Oh, sorry. Do you have any idea who Ray is? Sugar Ray. Not now, Mervyn. Cole doesn't have much of a sense of humor at the best of times. Ray runs a shop up on North Cherokee Avenue, just south of Hollywood Boulevard. Ray runs a shop. <laughs> like, why does he sound like that? <laughs> Wait, I want to hear him talk again. Where'd my partner go? Roy? My boy Roy, where you at? That's the guy from the paper. Solved that big case. Where did he just go? Am I tripping right now? Is he outside? Girl, I didn't even see you in the car. M move the f out You're the way. You're the wheel. Okay, wait. I kind of want to go back to the headed? hotel because why is this not crossed out? We we might have missed something important. Hammond is over the hill. He's a punching bag for the up-and-comers. She knows his goddamn oh place. I think he knows. I think he worked out the place isn't L.A. He's punchy. His brain's going to mush. Winston Churchill? Give me a break. Give me a break, bro. I'm Churchill is a fighter, Roy. Hammond didn't just scribble down the first name he could think of. Hmm. Rays, let's go. this coming in real quick wrinkled was not one of the things i wanted Sorry, to be when i grew up 
He worked that case with the lady cut up like the dog. I need to scour this place again. Hey, there's such a thing as soap, you know. Bathroom 206. If that heel won't buy me something nice, I'll find someone who will. Someone ought to take him home. He's loaded. When's America going to understand? It's about giving, not kidding. Three blondes walk into the bar. You think one of them is. Hmm. Hold on. God damn. Okay, no. It just, you just picks up this. I don't want that. I feel like I looked at everything here. Bro, get, get out of my way. Can I go out the window? this do anything? Yeah, I like looked at everything, bro. Hmm. I don't think this is any use to us. Yeah, bro. I don't know. Can I go up any higher? I recognize that guy from the papers. He's a cop. Do you know anything? I used to be indecisive. Damn. I don't know, man. It's like, I definitely... Wait, I'm not talking to you right now. Because I've looked at everything in this room. Hey, there's such a thing as soap, you know. There's no way I didn't. Did I look at this? Pick one up again. Stop. <laughs> this? I've looked at this already. There was nothing here. Oh. Yeah, I don't know, man. I think I'm just going to mark this as a lost cause, my bro. The only thing I can think of is maybe going outside the window and seeing if there's something down there. Oh, my voice cracked. I think that's what I'm gonna do. To see like where the window oh, goes, uh, you know? That's the guy. I heard he's an honest cop. Oh, there's an oxymoron for you. He wants a five star goddamn boy. Hey buddy, you drop something? Isn't that the cop who caught the guy that was pretending to be dead? Wait, which window is it? Will it be open from the from this angle? 
second mouse. Jeez. I thought it was the one with the parking lot. Someone ought to take them home. Hello? Yeah, that that window right there. I mean, it's not that high of a jump. Is there, is there truly nothing? No. My brilliant plan. Foiled again. Let me try. Anything over here? Hello? I don't know. I guess we'll just go to the next place. I can't think of anything I else. I recognize that guy from the papers. He's a cop. Here's what I heard. That cop caught the guy who did the Dahlia. But then they covered it all up. Some kind of big conspiracy. Can I talk? Can, can, can I click on this? Nope. All right, we're, we're, we, we, we gonna head out. You know the way. We can drive. Do we know where we're going? I don't need this. This broad's planning on cleaning out every bookmaker in town. Hammond needed to make sure he was getting a bigger payday than if he'd taken the flop. Never trust the limeys, especially where a fight's concerned. A mistake we can't seem to stop making. cab waiting up ahead she's not in the car don't get too close she must be inside we're on the move again Cole after her no. don't lose that cab oh this is gonna suck balls God damn it. Everyone's looking at us, Cole. How many stops is she gonna make? Watch it. Oh, shit. You're crazy. Yeah. You're gonna kill everyone. Hammond is full of himself. Being this sure he was gonna win. I hate this tailing shit. Oh, fuck, I lost it. Where'd it go? Wait, is this it? We're here? Okay, okay, okay. I got a pretty serious? funny idea of what keeping a low profile means, Phelps. That was not my fault. That bitch has given me what I'm owed. That's all I know.
Pull over. She's heading inside. Oh my god, that was so stressful. I really wrecked the car though, I'm not gonna lie. I think I just saw Hammond. I'll tail him. You get in there and stay with Candy. Make sure you don't let her see you. Oh, Lord. A skeleton goes into a bar and orders a beer and a mop. That cherry pie was delicious. One nice thing about egotists, they don't talk about other people. Hey, what are you doing? God damn. Hello? Whoa. What hey. the heck fire? There's such a thing as soap, you know? That's the guy. I heard he's an honest cop. <laughs> now that's an oxymoron for you. What the fuck, bro? I was not watching her. Call an ambulance. Hammond got away. <coughs> he said... Just try and sit still, Candy. Who shot you? Was it Albert? Car. I, I, <gasps> They're on the way. I have a patrolman searching the depot. The chief's putting together a manhunt for Hammond. He got the money, right? Looks like it. A tough bird, our limey friend. Using his girlfriend as the bag woman and then getting greedy over the split? He won't make it out of town. That's how you see it? I told you that cocksucker was a crook. It's rough out here. It's rough out here. But unfortunately, I think that's where we're going to leave things for today, you guys. Unfortunate end for that woman whose name I definitely remember um but we still we still have a, a killer to catch and by killer I mean well kind of yeah technically yeah a killer because he killed that woman um either way though let me put this switches over to the ending soon screen oh let me get you guys to your lo-fi beats I think we'll 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 let you guys dissolve into the void today. Um next stream will be tomorrow with either VLR or Dong Rupa V3. I'm not quite sure. But you know, you'll you'll know when I go live tomorrow. <laughs> As will I. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have not followed, you should do that. Um but yeah, other than that, take care of yourselves. And until next time, I'll see ya. Oh boy, y'all oh boy.